Hello and welcome back to another Microsoft Flight Sim video. First off, thank you to Alex W for recommending this video is a brilliant idea and I don't know why I never thought about it. But straight to the point, you may have bought yourself a Winwing FCU some time ago or you might have recently bought it and you've been flying the A320, the A319, the A321, whatever from Phoenix, from the Init Builds default one, from Fly-by-Wire, whatever. But you're like, you know what? I'd really, really love to use this FCU on a Boeing 737, or I'd like to use it in the caravan, or I'd like to use it in the, uh, the CRJ, right? There are so many different aircrafts available within the sim, and it'd be really nice to use it with anything that you'd like to. Well, you certainly can, and it's super, super easy. And the way to do it is by using this program called MobiFlight. Now, essentially, MobiFlight is a way for the software to communicate to the FCU and put in the information from the sim so that you can turn knobs, you can see it on screen, etc. And it's super simple, but it's also super advanced and complicated. Thanks to the wonderful community over at flightsim.to, they have come up with a bunch of different config files that you can use for MobiFlight. So all you have to do is go to flightsim.to, search for MobiFlight, and it will bring up all the different profiles here available. And you can search for the profile individually if you like to, or if you see it right away, go ahead and click it and download it. Now, what I have done is I have saved the profile, uh, sa sorry, save all my profiles in one folder so they're easily accessible. So you do however you like. And so for example, I'm using the iFly 737 Max. Now, right now, the Phoenix profile is currently loaded. And to do that, we go to file, we go to open, and you find your profile. So here's all my profiles I have available. And then you select the profile, right? Well, one thing after you've selected your profile, for example, we're gonna go and find the 737 uh, iFly profile. So as you see, I have a whole bunch of profiles. It takes a little bit to kind of sift through all of that. Uh, but we have, let's see, we have the, uh, we have the, this is the, Airbus one, I believe we have the, here's the iFly. So we have the Airfly, iFly there. We're going to click on that profile and open it. Once you open it, you can see here that it's already loaded in things for the output. These are things that's going to show up on the screen. We have input. These are things that when you turn the knob are going to react in the sim. And all you have to do is hit run, bam, just like that. So you can see it's pulling in information, sim value, 10,000. Output value, 10,000. So on my FCU, I now will see 10,000. You can see down here, speed, It's uh, the sim's giving me one. The output is giving me one. The barrel is giving me one. The output's giving me one. Now, some of them you're not going to see, but it's because of what's happening behind the scenes of how it's all working. Now, one thing that is truly, really, really cool about MobiFlight is if you have it auto run, so you see the little light bulb there it's lit up that means i have it auto run which means it's automatically going to run in the background fantastic right but i also want to automatically load this profile the iFly 737 whenever it's whenever i'm using this livery it's super simple come on down here to the bottom click on the button and click link config and now automatically, whenever I use this KLM livery, which I know is not real life, <laughs> right? But whenever I use this livery, it's going to automatically load that profile I have set up the, for the iFly for this plane. And it's truly amazing. So again, flights in that TO, you can find a whole bunch of free that people have made uh, config files that all you have to do is, is open it, run it, and there you have it. You now have an FCU that it works with pretty much any plane within the sim. And now if you want to go even advanced, you can make your own custom profile. There are McDo's that work. I also have an EFIS that will make it work with. So there are a ton of things you can do with MobiFlight and that is 100% free as well. If you do have a few bucks, send it over to the MobiFlight people because they are doing this all for free. And it is one of the best programs you can possibly have within the sim and if you have an alpha and a bravo from from honeycomb you can also customize programs with that as well thanks again for this uh video suggestion alex w 
And thanks everyone for watching and listening. If you have any suggestions for Moby Flight, pop them in, in the chat below because this is one of the best programs you can have. That's 100% free if you have the Winwing products. Thanks again. We'll see you next time. Take care.